Onu da söyleyeyim. Thanks to Lord Coffee for sponsoring a portion of this video. Hey everyone, welcome to another episode. This week we're touring the stunning 9.9 acre estate located on Havea Point within the famed Kapalı area. Bir dakika bunun Türkçesi yok mu ya? Heh. Resort here in Maui. This one features seven bedrooms, ten bathrooms, on the market for 49.9 million dollars. Lan geri zekalı altta Türkçe altyazı var tabi anlayacaksın. With that asking price, Yok, it is the most ona. expensive home for sale. Abi, bu sanki CGI gibi duruyor ya, Enes abi buradan. In the state of Hawaii, I want to give big thanks to the listing agents Yok, Tyler Coons and Andrea Dunn for making this tour possible. And now, let's begin our tour. Bana hitap etmiyor. Hele yarrama bak hele. Zengin evlerinde de bir sonsuzluk havuzu falan başlamış gidiyor ha moda herhalde bu sonsuzluk havuzu. Burası normal bir ev. Eve bakar mısın ya? Yani büyük ihtimalle şurası da onun. Ya buralar da ev sahibinin. Anladığım kadarıyla. Çok güzel yeri tutmuş abi adam. This property is situated on this 9.9 acre lot. From the street level we have the gates opening up to a private driveway. And that private driveway brings you to this point where we have the motor court. Driveway is nicely lined with palm trees. Beautiful landscaping and right in the center of this motor court we have this grass section with a water feature This water feature is also your koi pond, which is super cool and the layout of this property is really unique So on my right hand side we have an exterior hallway and that hallway opens up the four guest rooms that Dört misafir odası mı? That we will see later in the tour on my left hand side We have these French doors opening up to the gym. It comes with a stationary bike treadmill few weights and you can access this gym through the French doors here or through the three car garage. Oğuzum ev mi alacağım? Her gün farklı ev dolaşıyoruz. Bakıyoruz ya tersi öyle hangi evi alsak diye bir merak ediyoruz bakalım. Which is on the left. Bu ev alınmaz abi. Yani. Stuck on the exterior. Dün Jordan'ı aradım bu arada. Ee, dedim ki kral bunu bir gel indir dedim. Yani bir altı yap dedim anladın mı? Hani 15 oraya kimse vermez dedim oraya. 15 oraya kimse vermez dedim. Gel biraz düş dedim hani anladın mı? Sen çok istiyorsun dedim. Sen çok istiyorsun dedim. Yok abi dedi, son fiyat dedi. Yapacak bir şey yok dedi. Se sen hangi takılmışsın dedi. Fenerbahçe Beko dedim. He Chicago Bulls deseydim bir, bir milyon düşerdim altına da. Kusura bakma dedim Jordan. Fleet with glass doors and windows. This yani. custom green tile roof throughout. And with the palm trees. This driveway landscaping. This entry sets a great tone Öyle for the rest of the property. Şey. Arman is behind the camera today. It's his first time in Hawaii. Arman, what do you think so far? This is my first time in Hawaii, and I'm super excited because of the house is incredible. House is incredible. Views are stunning. I used to come Maui all the time when I was a professional windsurfer. So this episode is a little bit more special. And yes, Arman, I'm also very excited for this tour. Let's continue. Now, right in front of me, we have the covered section. This is a great feature. You can park your car here, especially when it's raining. That way you can stay dry. Take these steps, open these glass double doors to access your central courtyard. This is a phenomenal space with a water feature right in the center. This water feature is also your fire feature. We have outdoor seating areas throughout. On each corner, we have these built-in umbrellas, which complements the outdoor seating areas. You can see all these exterior hallways that connect all the rooms to each other. And on each corner, we also have these openings with glass screens allowing more natural air to come into the courtyard and improve the airflow here. Now, on the right hand side we have the guest house. Right in front of me we have the entertainment room. Behind me on the left we have a powder room 
for the courtyard that comes with two sinks. Right here, we have a door opening up to the steam room and this is a great private space for you to enjoy, throw parties, entertain. And lastly, we have this wing here. Now on the right hand side, we have the primary bedroom. On the left hand side, we have the hallway taking us to the four guest rooms that we will see in a bit. And lastly, we have these double glass pivot doors opening up to the gray room. Now, this is without a doubt one of my favorite rooms in this house. Vaulted ceilings, great volume, flee with sliding glass doors, open up this entire room to the outdoors. Your Infinity Edge pool, Namalu Bay right in front of us, stunning views. And these two columns allow the front to be totally open. You can even open up the sides and really connect this room to the outdoors. I love the wood clad ceilings. <clears throat> Ceiling fan right in the center. And first, let's talk about the seating area here. Sectional leather couch, two chairs. TVs on this side with built-in speakers. Right in the center, we have this really unique coffee table. There's a stainless steel bowl that is constantly moving. Inside the layer of this table is all sand, and it just creates this beautiful pattern. Once it's done with the pattern, it waits for like 30 minutes, and then it starts another pattern, which is oh, super wow. cool. I've never seen a piece of furniture like this before. Uh, if anybody knows the brand, let us know in the comment section below. Now, this is a great seating area. Gym, Behind wow. Ironman, we have a door opening up to a powder room for this level. Small seating area here. Another seating area on this side with a coffee table right in the center. Wood class ceilings give a ton of warmth to the space. And right in the center, we have the dining area. I really like this glass table with a metal frame and legs. These chairs look so modern and elegant. Seating for eight, located right in the center of the great room. And it complements your kitchen, which is on this side. This portion of the... Hocam, mutfak çok olmamış gibi be, he, chat. Sanki mutfak çok olmamış gibi geldi bana yani. Mutfağa mı takıldın? Abi bu eve bu mutfak gitmemiş be. Abi Sanki. bir şey diyeceğim. Bu evde yaşayan adam yemek yapmaz bu arada. Onu da söyleyeyim. Ne alaka kardeşim? Bu evin restorancısı olur yani. Ben böyle bir evde yaşasam yemek yapmam. Nasıl yani yapman? Dışarıdan söylerim. Kanka gözünü seveyim. Manyak olmayın ya. Param var. Restorancısı. Kim dedi restorancı diye? Ben dedin. Hayır restoranı olur dedim. Bu, bu adamın restoranı olur. Aşçısı olur. Bu evin bu adamın e, hizmetçileri olur. Bu adamın dört tane misafir odası diyor oğlum. İki tanesini zaten hizmetçileri verse aşçısı olur. Bahçıvanı olur. E, yardımcı aşçısı olur. Şefi olur. E, ondan sonra efendime söyleyeyim garsonu olur. E, smoothiecisi olur. E, kahvecisi olur. Çaycısı olur. Masaj olur mu masajcısı? Masaj olur. Buhar olur. Of. Cimcif olmaz ama onu söyleyeyim baba şimdi. Her şey olur cimcif olmaz. The video is sponsored by Lore Coffee. Before we continue our tour of this property, I want to talk about something that's really near. The beautiful kitchen, more of these warm wood. Tokmakçısı olur. Tones with the cabinetry. Right olur in the abi. center we have the island with a resin countertop. Bak bu güzelmiş işte bak bu güzelmiş. Bar stools that look very contemporary. Nice seating area here. Then we have the first set of built-ins on this side. Microwave, oven, your paneled freezer and fridge is located here. Your base cabinets, marble countertop, and they use the same marble as a backsplash here. Thermador gas cooked up, vent above, upper cabinets. Thermador gazlı ocak ne amına koyayım And we have the sink right here. There's a nice casement window right in front of it. That way you can enjoy the ocean views from your kitchen. Same vaulted ceiling design is also here, clad with this beautiful wood tone, cove lighting to cozy up the space. And that's pretty much it for your kitchen. It's nice and open and it's part of your great room. Now, Arman, let's take everybody this way. We talked about these smaller seating areas. 
hopefully with sliding glass doors open up, seamless transition. By the way, all the furniture is included with the sale of this property. And here we are at the backyard. Now this backyard is stunning. Same travertine continues to the exterior. We have two water features that overflow to each other and then to the infinity edge pool. I'm on, why don't we go this way so we can talk about the outdoor kitchen here. First bar seating on this side, second bar seating on my left, marble countertops. Right in the center, we have the wolf gas grill, sink, and this is a great space that complements your backyard. Now, let's talk about the pool setup. It looks stunning, so, yeah. mosaic clad throughout. Baja shelf and the jacuzzi is on the left hand side. Juicy, Infinity yeah. edge. These views are breathtaking. I mean, this is gorgeous. Namalu Bay right in front of us. Kapalua Bay right next to that. The island on our right hand side is Molokai. And the island that is right in front of us is Lanai. These views are breathtaking. You have the ocean right in front of you. It constantly moves and changes. And this is such a relaxing view. I mean, I love this place. You have palm trees on each side, travertine around your pool, lounging areas, built-in umbrellas. This backyard setup is stunning. Now, I wanna take everybody this way so we can talk about the grounds. Havea Point is named. Acaba Enes abi takılıyor mudur la bu evde? Bir hafta falan. Hani video çek diye alıyor ya. Öyle bir iki hafta takılıyor mudur acaba evde? Ne diyorsunuz? The name of the peninsula or this promontory that we're situated on is this natural rock formation. Because of our elevation, the views we get are simply stunning. You have a small walkway here that takes you to a gate, and that gate is your private beach access. This beach is known for snorkeling and cliff diving. Our grounds are fantastic. We're situated on 9.9 .9 acres, and it's all to yourself. You don't have any neighbors. And this is really what you're paying for. I mean, this is the most expensive home currently on the market in the state of Hawaii. But this peninsula, this setting, the privacy, the home itself is such a unique offering. And that's really what you're paying for. Now let's turn back so we can talk about the house itself. Single story home, sliding glass doors open up to the outdoors. That's the great room right there. I really like this green tile roof, which helps it blend with the landscaping around. And this section here is where we have the guest suites. In total, we have four bedrooms Good here. I'm gonna start our tour with this one, small patio space. Outdoor shower shared by the guest room on the other side. We have fleet with sliding glass doors opening up, seamless transition. We have the king size bed here. I love this modern bed frame, two side tables, open bathroom design here right in the center. We have this freestanding tub with a built-in shelf around it. Two sinks, beautiful vanity, and glass door opens up to your walk-in shower with a rain head, all travertine clad, massive TV here, dressing table, small desk setup, which is a really cool accessory, built-in closets. And I really like that these bedrooms or these guest suites open up to the grounds and to these views. They also have their own private entry with a lock, which means you can use these bedrooms as small hotel rooms. Now, we're back at the motor court. This exterior hallway takes us to the second guest room, which starts here. It's pretty much the same layout. You have your open bathroom here with two sinks, glass enclosed walk-in shower, freestanding tub. Your bed is situated here. Another big TV, fleet with sliding glass doors open up to a private patio, outdoor shower. And I really appreciate that these guest suites all have a really nice bathroom, spacious bed area, private patios, outdoor showers. They have all these amenities within the room itself. Now, let's continue. Our tour, I want to take everybody back to this exterior hallway. Again, we have the motor court on our left hand side. This hallway takes us to the third guest suite, and I really appreciate the indoor outdoor flow of this property. When you think about it, we don't have any interior hallways. You have to walk outside to get to the next room. It allows you to interact with nature Vallahi and it allows you to enjoy the amazing weather that we have here in Maui. Now, this is the third guest suite, another king size bed, fully with sliding glass doors open up, another private patio, 
incredible views. You have your open bathroom here. And in case you want some privacy, they actually have these built-in curtains to create some separation between the bathroom and the bedroom itself. And these rooms are perfect for your guests or your family members. Now, let's continue back to the exterior hallway. We have this door opening up to the last guest suite. Pretty much the same finishes. Again, we have the bathroom and the shower on this side. Your bed is situated here. Flee with glass doors open up to these incredible views. Now that's pretty much it for the guest wing. Now I want to take everybody back to the courtyard so we can continue our tour with the primary bedroom suite. Again, we have the doors here opening up to the great room. This courtyard allows all these rooms to get natural light and coming here, the exterior hallway takes us to the primary bedroom wing. King size bed right in the center. We have a small seating area here. High ceiling. Amına koydumun çoyu ay yaşı yine mi gittin içmeye piç? Haksız mıyım kardeşim? Böyle olmamalıydı abi. Gerçek yatak odası abi bu. Gözün sen böyle gerçek yatak odası mı olur ya? Olmaz abi. Almıyorum abi. Almıyorum vazgeçtim. Good lighting throughout. Plaster walls. Room has a very cozy feel. Then we have these Fleetwood sliding glass doors opening up to your grounds and to these no, breathtaking no. views. This set of sliding glass doors takes you to the backyard. Out on the distance, you can see the Sizde island of Molokai. And I'm going to talk more about these grounds in a bit. Now, this primary bedroom suite comes with two bathrooms. We have the first one here. This is your outdoor bathroom. But I want to start our tour with the indoor bathroom, which starts here. 42 million mu? Video başına dedi mi onu? Üf, Enes abi de sürpriz olayı yok ha hiç. Vallahi sürpriz olayı yok ha. 42 milyon niye diyor başta ya kanka? Anam mı bu ses? Floating vanity with two sinks, natural stone ha, countertop, şey, şey mirror yapıyoruz, assembly da. here with two built-in medicine cabinets. 41.9 mu? Okey tamam tamam. We have some additional plugs here. Michael Jordan izledik dün. Then, right where Arman is, we have a water closet with a stone waste cutting. Then on my left hand side, we have the walk-in shower. I really like this glass barn door. Travertine clad throughout for the most part. And on this wall, we have this book match, backlit onyx stone, which looks stunning. Brush nickel fixtures, terrain heads. This door opens up to your outdoor shower that is facing the backyard. And lastly, we have the freestanding tub here, brush nickel, floor mount tub filler. We have sliding glass windows here, opening up to the views. We currently have this glass assembly clear, but with a push of a button, you can frost this glass for some additional privacy. Overall, beautiful bathroom, and it flows straight to your walk-in closet. Built-in cabinetry throughout for all your clothes. Right in the center, we have this massive safe. And continuing our tour, we're back right in the center, we have this massive safe. And continuing our tour, we're back at the entry of this primary bedroom. Now, I want to tour the second bathroom here, which is your outdoor bathroom. This space is so cool. Right above us, we have this glass roof assembly. And below this glass roof assembly, we have these openings with screens, allowing natural air and natural light to come into this space. Then you have your fleet with sliding glass doors with seamless transition to the outdoors. Right in the center of this bathroom, we have this freestanding tub with a tub filler. Then your open showers on this side with two rain heads. Onyx slab that creates a beautiful contrast against travertine walls. Your handheld is here. This glass enclosed section is your water closet. You have your toilet, modern pedestal sink. And lastly, I want to talk about this detail. We mentioned it at the courtyard. We have these openings with glass screens allowing more natural air to come in. It helps with the airflow in the courtyard as well as this bathroom. Also, in case you're wondering about the privacy, you have a built-in shade here. You can close it off that way. No one can see you from this hallway. Now, that's pretty much it for this outdoor bathroom. Now I want to go outside so we can check. 
Açık hava banyosu ne amına koyayım ya. Check out the grounds on the side. 9.9 acres. You have this entire promontory all to yourself. No neighbors. Beautiful grounds. Breathtaking views. We have the island. Takası açık mı ev sahibi? Ne vereceksin kanka? Çok merak ettim. Allah aşkına. Açık diyelim. Bu adam takası açık diyelim. Dexti. Neyle takas yapacaksın? Bu evi 41.9 milyon dolar. <gülüyor> ne? Takaslık olay ne bura? Ne vereceksin? 91 pro'yu. <gülüyor> ya neden böyle bir soru sordu ki? Durduk yere gerçekten neden böyle bir soru sorduğunu merak ediyorum abi bak. Yani hani diyelim ki ev sahibiyle seni oturttuk bir masaya. Okey mi? Ve ev sahibi de sana dedi ki kardeşim benim evim takasla ta şey açıktır takası açıktır. Ne vereceksin ki 41.9 milyon dolar edecek ya. İmkansız abi 42 oğlum bak ben dünkü Jordan evinde de söyledim. Tamam ev harika 40 dönüm müthiş her şey düşünülmüş e, harbiden yapılmış vesaire ama kanka gerçekten abartıyorlar ya. Chat gerçekten abartıyorlar abi. Ya bu ev 42 milyon dolar değil amına koyayım ya. Değil kanka ya. Taş şattasın 3 milyon dolar. <gülüyor> Adam araziye veriyor abi demek ki o parayı. Alın o Molokai on the distance. Onoloa Bay right behind me. Arazi zaten para arazi de. I mean evet. it feels amazing to be here and I feel like if I owned a property like this I would spend majority of my time outside hanging around in different parts of this backyard drinking a coffee, reading a book, just enjoy being in Maui. It's also really oh, windy today so I'm going to do our best to protect our mic. But that's pretty much it for the grounds. Setting here is just stunning. Now Coming this way, we have this covered seating area. It actually leads us to the entertainment lounge. Ama bir kere bu evi alacaksan benim birkaç sorum var. Bir, metroya kaç dakika? İki, ee, plaja ne kadar uzaklıkta? Üç, halk plajına ne kadar uzaklıkta? Dört, eğlence alanları ne kadar uzak? Beş, ee, market, ee, benzin, ee, alışveriş merkezleri kaç kilometre uzağında? E, altı, okul, hastane... Ee, iş, güç yerlerine ne kadar uzak? Helikopter pisti var mı? Efendime söyleyeyim ga işte garajı kaç araba alıyor? Ee, alıyorsa tüplü alıyor mu? Bunlar önemli sorular abi. Benim o ev sahibiyle bir birebir görüşmem lazım yani bu konular hakkında. 10. Cami var mı yakınlarında? 2 glass pivot doors here. And as we go in, we have the pool table on my right hand side. İnternet altyapısında fiber internet var mı? Varsa hangi marka, hangi şirket? Bunlar önemli sorular. Chandelier above, vaulted ceilings, mood lighting throughout. We have some built-in shelving here, small bar area with a fridge to complement the space. Then facing back to the ocean, we have two massive picture windows. And in front of these windows, we have önemli small seating abi. areas. Your sectional couch is located here. More light fixtures above, just a phenomenal space, and I feel like this is a great space. Hey, Enes abi, sen abartıyorsun bazen. Adam dümdüz köşe takımı koymuş oraya ya. Phenomenal space diyor. Dümdüz köşe takımı abi o. Yani görmesek hayatımızda daha önce şey yapmasak yedireceğim biz daha sen de Enes abi. Baya dümdüz köşe takımı ya. To entertain, have friends over, throw parties, flow straight to the grounds. And as you guys can see, you can just open up these glass pivot doors, have great natural airflow. It just feels amazing to be here. Now, let's continue our tour. Back to the central courtyard. I'm gonna take this hallway here. By the way, on these walkways or in the central courtyard, we have up. Bu evi alan sadece ev değil, statüyü de Allah katına taşıyor. Tövbe estağfurullah, tövbe ya Rabbim. Kardeşim benim, bence, tövbe ya ben daha olmadım da, olan varsa chatte söylesin. <gülüyor> O kadar zenginlerin artık bence yoktur ya böyle takıntıları. Yani sen işte, zengin değil misin? Yok. Ha işte Hawaii'nin en pahalı evinde oturayım. İşte Hawaii'nin böyle şöyle bir evi var. Şunun içine bir gireyim de ben ben oturuyorum desinler. Sanmıyorum öyle bir şey olduğuna yani. Other speakers, built-in seating areas, ceiling mount planters. These French doors open up to the side of the property and coming back here. 
pek çok... Ama ne yapayım Paris gittin geldin yok diyor. Lan ne Paris gittin geldin? Gittik bir Disneyland'e oturduk. İki kruvasan yedik. Üç e, tatlı yedik. Ben galiba sadece yedim ya Paris'te. Ama güzeldi tatlılar şey. Güzeldi yani. Ayakkabı ayakkabı alışveriş falan. Öyle güzeldi ya çok şey. window from the guest house. And we have these double doors opening up to the guest house. E, bak e, elimdeki euroyu şöyle veriyordum bak. <gülüyor> itself. This part of the house comes with two bedrooms. This open seating dining area right in the center. And we have the kitchen on this side. <gülüyor> I love the vaulted ceilings here that are wood clad with mood lighting. It just warms up the space and goes really well with the hardwood floors that we have throughout. Again, you have your dining area in the center, TV on this side. This is basically your little hangout area for these Bilim two bedrooms that we're going to tour. Let's start with this bedroom. We have a pocket door here that seals it off. Two bunk beds, built-in cabinetry here with a desk set up right in the center. Facing these ocean views. Double doors open up to the side of the property. Overall, aslında bu evi alıp yurt yapacağım aman akıyım. Ha? Chat ne diyorsun? Bu evi alıp var ya yurt yapacağım aslında. Böyle paralı. Öyle bir şey olabilir. Bu arada hocam bir tane video isteğe geldi. Bunu galiba geçen yayın izlememiştik. Karışık çerez 88'i. Bunu ekleyelim de. Hani o adamın keyfi olsun. Ee, darlayıp duruyor çünkü. Ee, vallahi izleyeceğim. Ya bu nasıl yani sahibi Bekir'di değil mi? Bu Bekir benden bu kadar istememiştir ha bu video izlememi. Sana söz veriyorum kardeşim bunu izleyeceğim. İzleyeceğim bunu. Ama bugün mü onu bilmiyorum ama böyle şeyin olsun diye bunu buraya koydum yani. Good size guest bedroom and this would be a phenomenal space for kids. Now, let's go back to the dining area so we can check out the second bedroom. It ben starts here. This one also comes with bunk beds, built-in cabinetry, another desk set up, picture window facing the courtyard. And I really like that they kept the wall in between these two bedrooms a little bit more lower. That way natural light can travel throughout the space or throughout the guest house. Now, that's it for the bedrooms. I want to take everybody this way so we can check out this kitchen. They use the same wood tone cabinetry that we saw at the main kitchen, also here. This is a phenomenal space, massive island right in the center, ton of cabinetry, your 48 inch Thermador gas stove is located here. Dual elevation with Baba, the bar. Gazlı olacak, ne oluyor? Bilen var mı? Bar seating that opens up Thermador, to your dining area, vent above. Windows on this side, your first sink, First dishwasher is here, and then we have the second sink and second dishwasher on the other side. You have a massive Thermador commercial fridge here, full-size wine fridge, bolted ceilings above, again wood clad, and this house recently been through a major remodel, and this kitchen was part of that remodel as well. Overall, beautiful space, and this kitchen is designed like a caterer's or chef's kitchen because you can access the courtyard from here as well as the three car Bak, garage bu mutfak okey işte kanka bu mutfak okey işte bu evin mutfağı böyle olmalı değil mi az önceki mutfak okey değildi abi bu evin mutfağı böyle olmalı abi on top of that on the bu, back budur. we have a commercial pantry with multiple budur freezers abi. that way your chef your caterers can come here prepare the food service the courtyard or the rest of the property now let's continue our tour we have a door here opening up to the laundry room two washers two dryers sink we have plenty of cabinetry then we have another door that opens up the hallway which then leads us to the three car garage on the left hand side we have additional three washers and three dryers no, so in total ya. we have five sets of dryers which is super cool considering the amount of bedrooms and rooms you have these laundry machines come in handy Değil abi, bu kadar da fazla ya. now let's come here french doors opening up to the motor court then we have this door opening up to the commercial pantry when i said commercial enerji sınıfı değil bunlar ah be kanka berk ah be kanka ne? Yo şeyler makineler enerji sınıfı değilmiş de chatten biri takıldı. 
Alınmaz mı diyorsun o zaman bu ev? Vazgeçiyor mu o zaman? Hocam selamun Berkem hoş geldin aleyküm selam. Hoş buldum hoş buldum günaydın. Alınmaz çok yakın okey abi okey abi. Niye fazla birader? Farklı ırklardaki insanların çocuk sayısı fazla oluyor onlara çok uygun bir ev. Haklı. Ya ne alakası var kaysı manyak mısın? Zaten hayvan gibi şehirleri var amına koyayım yani kapasiteleri var şu makinelerin. Here opening up to the laundry room. Bak iki bur iki işte şey diyelim yıkama iki kurutma diyelim tamam mı? Two washers, two dryers, sink. We have plenty of cabinetry. Then we have another door. Altı tane daha yıkamaya ne gerek var amına koyayım? Ne yapıyorsun? Which then ya? leads us to the three car garage. On the left hand side we have additional three washers. 3 tane de yıkama 3 de kurutma. Ne yapıyorsun abi sen bu kadar şeyi? And three dryers. So <gülüyor> tamam birer tane daha koy ya. Ben sana bir şey diyeyim. Alakası yok bu arada belki. Şu evin ne, böyle. Ne. Bence buraya başka ne koyabilirim mi düşünmüş? Tamam mı? Buraya başka ne koyulabilir ee? acaba? Ben burayı nasıl doldurabilirim ya? Burası çok boş kaldı. Böyle olmadı demiş. Ve iki 4 tane daha almış yanına. İki tane yıkama, iki tane mesela, kurulma daha almış bence. Chat'te mesela çok güzel bir teori var. Çalışanların olabilir mi peki hocam bu? Abicim bak, bak bir şey diyeceğim. Üç kurutma, üç yıkama, yirmi kişiyi ee? kaldırır. Tamam da sen şimdi şöyle düşün mesela. Çok zenginsin tamam mı? Tamam. Çalışanların var. Tamam. Sen kıyafetlerini o çalışanların kıyafetleriyle birlikte yıkar mıydın? Lan tamam iki tane... Dört tanesini onlara veririm. Tamam işte adam da kendini almış. Sikinin keyfi parasını canı istediği kadar almış. Lan geri adam zekalı mı bu adam? Almış. Ya alakası yok sikinin keyfi falan. Ya adamın parası var sikinin alakası keyfi. Alakası yok alakası ne yok demek kardeşim. Alakası yok. alakası yok. Bu adamın şu fazlalık dört tane makineyi almasının tek sebebi burayı doldurmak için. Bu makineler bir kere açıldıysa gelsin ben siksin. Bu makineler... Bir kere açıldıysa belki biri bozulmuştur, diğerini kullanmıştır onu okuyayım. Ama aynı anda bu makinelerin hepsi aynı anda çalıştıysa gelin ben sikin amına koyayım. Aynı anda hepsini nasıl çalışsın ya? Biri yıkanırken biri kurutur. Mayak mısın ya? Lan sen geri zekalı mısın? Ya bu ayrı bir salak bunu boş sen versene. Sen tam marsın lan sen. In total you have five sets of washer and dryers which is super cool considering the amount of bedrooms and rooms you have. These laundry machines come in handy. Now, let's come here. French doors opening up to the motor court. Then we have this door opening up to the commercial pantry. When I said commercial pantry, I meant it. You have all these freezers and fridges. Bak Allah aşkına, nusret misin baba sen? Sen nusret misin kardeşim? Bu ne amına koyayım ya? Then you have built-in cabinetry adam, here and check this out. Hi Mike, can we get a close-up? These all pull out, that way you can utilize the space all the way to the back very easily and it just complements the guest house kitchen. Wrapping around, it gets better, you have additional cabinetry here. Bu dünyaya ne olduysa bu zenginlerin aç gözlülüğünden oldu zaten. Overall, it's a phenomenal space that complements the... Bu zenginlerin aç gözlülüğünden oldu ne olduysa bu dünyaya. Abi bir şey diyeceğim. Sen hani diyorsun ya makine yok aynı anda falan filan. Ne? E sen de aynı anda o çizgi romanları okuyamıyorsun. O kadar enayi gibi para verdin. Lan geri zekalı aynı mantık mı? Ben o, o ne yapıyor o adam çamaşır makinesi? Ben bir gün bunu okurum. Bunlar benim şu anda değerlim. Bunlar benim istediğim zaman şey yaptım koleksiyonum. Bu amına koyduğum o adamı lan dur ya ben mesela ben 3 sene sonra çizgi roman okuyacağım. Bu adam da şey mi diyecek 3 sene sonra? Lan dur lan ben çamaşır makinesi almıştım. Açayım da bir içine gireyim mi diyecek bu adam. Ne yapacak? Ben bunları her türlü değerlendiririm. Baktım amına koyayım şey değil. En kötü tek tek açarım. Bitirene kadar hayatımın sonuna kadar okurum. Bu adam ne yapacak? Hayatının sonuna kadar o çamaşır makinelerini kullanabilecek mi? Satıyor işte al. Satıyor evi. Demek ki olmamış. İzle Demek ki istediğini yapamamış. İzle videonu. Now, let's open up this door. So... Satar değerlenince. Lan orası Türkiye mi amına koyayım? Orada dolarla bir şey alınca onun fiyatı düşer. Artmaz. 
We can check ekonomileri iyi yani. Check out the side of the property where you can access the grounds. They have a small orchard here with avocado, Türkiye'de orange and banana trees, which is great since it's right next to your kitchen. Türkiye'de grounds of this property is so beautiful. They maintain it so well. House itself is in a pristine condition and I feel like someone can do a lot with this property. Bizim kötü mü? Çok şükür kardeşim benim hiçbir şey söylemedim o konu hakkında. Gayet güzel bir ekonomimiz var. Uh, they have approved plans for 10,000 square foot addition and a pool cabana, which means someone can expand this property in the future. Overall, it feels amazing to be here, and I'm really glad we came all the way out to Maui to tour this property and share it with all of you. Ev çok güzel, yalan yok. Ar bir yalan yok. Ev çok güzel. Gece görünümü de harika. 40 dönümlük bir araziye kurulmuş olması da ayrı bir harika. Ama 41.9 milyon dolarlık bir ev mi? Hayır. Abi Para biz kaçırdık mıydı da. Abi? Ee, en baştan bir izleyebilir miyiz? Abi kas siktir 23 dakikadır bunu izliyoruz ya.